Hey, Dustin Tibbetts here, financial advisor with Jazz Wealth Managers, and today I'm gonna give you four tips, four things you wanna consider, and in order, by the way, on how you might wanna get started investing, no matter how you're gonna in invest, actually, as you go. Um, this is our FinTip series, so we keep it really short, right to the point, and we just sort of teach you something and get out of the way. If we help you, maybe you'll hit the subscribe button. If you need help, maybe you'll check us out at jazzwealth.com, I appreciate it. Okay, here we go, let's dive right in. Number one, what are you investing for? What, what, what's the goal? Is it retirement or is it what we like to call personal wealth account? Just a separate individual account that maybe you want to use for some kind of investment. Look, if it's a retirement account, you're going to want to choose the type, right? So if you are not really excited about paying taxes in the future and you don't mind paying now, you might consider the Roth IRA. If you find yourself in a position where you could use a tax deduction now and you'll just deal with the tax stuff later, then maybe a traditional IRA would be the case. But Roth IRA, traditional IRA, um, you'll want to weigh those differences. If maybe you're a business owner, maybe a SEP IRA, or something like that. It's, of course, something you want to look into. We have tons of great videos on all of the different types of accounts, but that's your first step. What are you investing for? Um, and then if it's retirement, you want to choose the account type. If it's just a personal wealth account or an individual account, then you're going to want to do some research on brokerage firms. You might find that you don't know a lot or you don't have a lot of money, and so you just need something basic that doesn't cost a lot, that's really cheap or free to trade, and that might be something like a Robin Hood if that's the way you're going. Um, you may decide that you have a lot of money and you want to be more active, you want more research, you want more education, and so you might look at a TD Ameritrade or an E-Trade if you're going to be like an active trader. There's lots of other great ones, by the way, for active traders. Um, or it may be something like a, a, just a regular Fidelity account. You're happy with that sort of thing or a Schwab. Um, so you'll want to do your research there. That's number one. What are you investing for? And then either do research on the account type for retirement or do research on the company, the brokerage firm that you're going to use. Uh, number two, what is the goal for your account? So we know what we're investing uh, for, retirement or just it's one of our individual accounts. Now what's the goal? If you could have it perfectly, if everything goes well, what would you like to happen? And we'll start with the retirement account. If it's the retirement account, you need to know your number, right? Everybody on the planet, even the government is starting to, uh, is working through some laws that they're putting through Congress right now uh, to make 401ks focus on something I've been saying now for years that you don't need to know the dollar amount that you need to have in your account. Knowing that you'll have a million dollars doesn't do anything. Everyone who plays that game that says, if I had a million dollars and I just took out 4% a year and lived off the interest, I would never run out of money. Not technically true in real practice, okay? So um, if it's your retirement account, you need to know what's the income you need in retirement. So the day I retire, my paycheck that's now coming from me needs to be about this much. Figure that out. We do all we do that for every one of our customers. We, we sort of force them uh, to give us that data so that we can do that. If it's a, a personal wealth account or an individual account, are you, what are you thinking? What, what's the goal? You want to be a day trader and see if you can make some money? Do you want to build up something that maybe is, is passive, dividend related? Do you like real estate? You want to use it for things like that? Um, are you a value investor and you only like to buy things when they've sold off aggressively and you'll take your chance on those? Either way, you're going to want to know that goal stated ahead of time just like anything else, a diet, uh, exercise routine, you're going to state the goal ahead of time. Number three, um, what do you need to learn, right? You're probably watching this right now because you think you need to learn something about starting to invest, okay? So check out our other videos. Of course, we cover lots of different things. And every day at five o'clock, I actually do a complete stock market update, right? Real short, 10, 15 minutes, go over everything that's happened in the markets. Um, so maybe you learn from watching that show. Um, the question is, if you're retirement based, will you learn from YouTube? Will you ask your parents? Where will you go for information to help you decide what type of retirement account to open, what your goal should be? I certainly hope you'll keep us in mind here at Jazz Wealth, but it doesn't have to be. It could, it could be someone that you notice is doing well saving for retirement as well. If it's a, a personal wealth account, are you going to pay somebody to help you? There are lots of great services out there that will pay or that you can pay that will teach you how everything works. They, they're not gonna get you rich and some give you some secret strategy, but they'll teach you how everything works. A lot of times if you use the bigger brokerage firms, you just look for the education tab, click that sucker and there'll be all kinds of great help there for you, not only on how to use the software, but also how everything works. So what do you need to learn is tip number three and are you gonna pay for it or just soak it up as you go? No problem either way. Uh, the fourth tip I have for you is, 
are you going to do this yourself or are you going to get help? Now, from a retirement perspective, I think you know what I'm gonna say, right? Like, call us up, work with us, we'll do it for you, and kind of walk you through the process. That's okay. You could use a financial advisor, you could use uh, some online system if you like, um, but you wanna make that decision. Do you have the time, do you have the knowledge, the excitement, the, the wonder to actually wanna do it yourself? And if so, go for it. Do, just keep soaking up the knowledge and do it. If you go, look, I, I don't know how this all works. I'm not gonna watch videos. I don't wanna take the time. Turns out my passion is building houses or something else. Um, so I'm gonna find somebody to do this for me. Then great, for retirement accounts, there's plenty of options. Uh, I sort of think we're the best, but you know, I'm kind of biased. <laughs> If it's a personal wealth account, um, then if you're going to do it yourself, that's most likely going to be the case. But there are lots of different robotic ways or automated ways that you can invest passively or actively if you're a day trader. They're not all great, but you can do your research and look into it. So there you go. That's the four tips that I have for you. Number one, you're going to want to know what are you investing for, right? Number two, what's the goal for that account? Number three, what do you need to learn, if anything? Maybe you know everything already. And number four, are you going to do it yourself or are you going to get help? Well, if you need help, hopefully we have helped you in some way here. Check out our other videos that are also really short and to the point. Um, also our five o'clock show, the, uh, the closing beat is what we call it, to go over the stock market. And if you need any help as far as your investments go or you want someone to do it for you, I hope you'll check us out at Jazz Wealth. Enjoy. Hey, Dustin Tibbetts here, financial advisor. Why should you choose Jazz Wealth as your retirement or long-term investing service? Our portfolios are managed by us, not some faceless mutual fund manager. Our private classes will teach you everything about investing and getting your dough straight. Best of all, our fiduciary standard means your best interest comes before ours.